Welcome everyone, I'm going to do a quick tutorial on how to use the Corridors of Time TJ side combined with Corridor Crunch to help out the big sheet that all the uh, streamers are working on. It's a very simple tutorial, the only thing we'll need to do before starting, what I recommend, is getting this thing, it's an invert, it will help for the old version. I will put a link down in the description, it's basically an extension for Chrome and Edge that will let you turn the pictures inverted. Once you've done that, you'll head to this website, corridorcrunch.com slash transcribe, or the new one, I will post both of them as well into the description, and also you'll head to tgl.co slash corridors of time, also will be in the description. Once you're on this page, the process is very same for both of these, the new one and the old one. I will show you how to do it using the old version, since the new one is not currently working as the image doesn't show up. Once it shows up, it will come down here. It will be at the bottom of the page. And all the other steps are the same. So on this one, you will have the image here. If you click on it, it will open it. Then you will use this button, which you used from the extension to toggle the inversion and just zoom in. Make sure that the image is the right way up. The way you can tell this is up here, this pillar and these four pillars are always at the top. So singular and four pillars are always the ones at the top. Make sure that the gun and the feet and the HUD are not obstructing any symbols. If either of those are the case, you want to check report badge image or warn others that the image is rotated. The same here on the new one. It would be flag image quality if it's blurred or any other thing, or flag image rotation if it's rotated. Once you've made sure that the image is correctly rotated and no part is obscured, you want to zoom in on the image and start transcribing it. So you want to start in the middle, make sure the symbol is matching by just clicking on it on TJ and then selecting a symbol. This is quite easily done. Once you've done that, you want to put in the borders. So as you can see, these four borders are not there, but these two are. So just click on the borders which are filled out and it will fill them out on the website. Then you will start transcribing. So just look at the images over here and put them in. If it's blank, just leave it, it's automatically blank. If you make a mistake, just go back and put it blank or correct it. That's all you have to do. Once you've completed your image, all you have to do is scroll down on the page and you will see this raw JSON code. Select it all, right click and copy, go back to the corridors of page time and paste it in the raw JSON box. Then you press submit. It will then submit it. It is similar on this one. All you'd have to do is go on the JSON sequence, right click, paste, and then press submit sequence. On the new one, you also do not have to open a new page. You can already use the inversion slider to inverse it. Once you've pressed submit, just press display new image and you'll get a new page. On this one, it will automatically give you a new image. So just keep going and we'll be able to solve this puzzle in no time. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did like it, subscribe, whatever. And uh, my Twitch and Twitter, all of that will be down in the description. Have a good day. Bye.